In Vijayanagar, they used to live a person named Udanka. Just like everyone has their unique identity, Udanka was known for his stinginess. He was so miserly that he used to wear his sandals in his hands. <laughs> it was so much fun. What a wonderful wedding it was. Such lavish arrangement, tasty food and those coconut sweets. Wow, wow, wow. I have never eaten such tasty coconut sweet in my lifetime. Money is honey. <laughs> you haven't eaten such coconut sweets? And me, I have never tasted a single sweet after marrying a miser like you. Huh. Oh, my dear. Let the next party invitation come. I'll keep two extra sweets for you. But God knows, when will the next party happen? Why wait for the next party? Just bring me the coconut and I'll make it for you. Wait, what am I asking for? To ask you to bring coconuts is such a waste of time. Because you're such a miser, just to save money, you don't even wear your sandals on your feet. You're so stingy that you don't even buy wheat and lentils. And you wish to have coconut sweets. Forget about the wheat and lentils. If you're ready to make coconut sweets, I'll bring the coconut right away. What do you say? Mm. Okay, sure. Go get it. I'll get it now. Buy fresh and healthy coconuts. Buy fresh and healthy coconuts. Uh, 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 how much for a coconut? Each coconut costs only five coins. Mm. <laughs> Five coins? Mm -hmm. uh, you should be ashamed of quoting such mm -hmm. a high price. <laughs> Lower the price for me, money is honey. If you want to save money, then walk for 10 miles in this direction. And you can get the coconuts for just three coins each. What? The mm. same coconut in just three coins instead huh? of five? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Why should I waste my sweat for this? I can use it later somewhere. Udanka reaches the other coconut cellar, where his greed to save money increases. If you want these coconuts in two coins instead of three, walk for another ten miles in this direction. To save money, I can travel to any corner of the world. <laughs> <laughs> If I could get some ride. Wow! Got it! <laughs> Why didn't it kick me harder? At least that way I could have fallen right at the coconut shop. Uh, listen, I have walked here all the way from Vijayanagar. Do you want me to break coconuts to welcome you? That would be great, if possible. You can keep the water and the peel. Just give me the coconut. Money is honey. <laughs> uh, by the way, uh, can I get the full huh? coconut in one coin, please? Why not? You came here from so far. Take this coconut. Huh? Huh? What is this? I had asked for the entire coconut, but it's just the coconut shell. For one coin, you'll get only this. Now just leave. Go away. Go, go from here. Ah. My friend, you can get the coconuts free of cost. Huh? All you need to do is walk huh? another 10 miles from uh. here. Once you reach uh -huh. the beach, you can pluck as many coconuts uh -huh. you want for uh -huh. free. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Wow, wow! <laughs> so many coconuts! My coconuts! <laughs> <laughs> come on! Oh, come on! What, what is this happening? Save me! Somebody help me get down! Please, anybody listening, please! Help! Is anybody listening? Money is honey! Oh. Hmm? Oh. 
How did this happen? How I win, I'll tell you everything. But first, help me get down from here, please. Uh -huh. But how can I help you? You are handling such a big elephant. But can't you use a little bit of your brain? Buddy, huh? buddy. Just stand on your elephant and hold my leg so that I can get down. Is it okay? Oh, no. This will take so much time. And I'm in a little hurry, you know. But yeah, if you give me a hundred coins, then I might help you. Otherwise... Hundred coins? <laughs> I came here walking just to save some money. And you are asking me for a hundred coins? No, no. I'm not forcing you to do this. Take all the time you need while hanging on the tree. I'll take your leave. Wait, wait, wait. I'm ready. I'll give you a hundred coins. <laughs> you just get me down from here. <laughs> Let's go, Apu. Hmm. Ah, good job. Keep going. Come on, stretch your legs a bit. Oh no, Apu! Don't leave me hanging, Apu! I came here to help you, and now I'm also hanging with you. <laughs> Who do I call now? I cannot see anyone around. Someone is there. Help us! Save us! Huh? Yeah! Huh? Huh? <laughs> now only you can help us get down, brother, please. Mm? Well, sure. Why not? It will only take 1,000 coins in return for helping you. Mm. What? 1,000 coins? <laughs> Do you have any idea how much stinginess it takes to save 1,000 coins? I can buy 1,000 coconuts from those 1,000 coins. Yes, you're right. But I also know that if you don't give me 1,000 coins, then your bones may break into 1,000 pieces. Anyway, I'll take your leave. Uh, uh, okay, okay. I'll pay. I'll pay. <laughs> Did the horse have to show its stunt at this exact moment? Hey, my hands are slipping now. Oh, don't let go, or else all of us will fall. Everything is ruined now. My coins. Dear, are you there? What happened to you? And how much did this coconut cost you? One thousand huh? coins. A merchant named Bhaskar used to sell his goods in Vijayanagar's market. But this time, Apart from his fruits, grains, and other goods he sold, he had something else in his cart. And that was his chubby little son, Bhanu Varma. Bhanu, hmm? come look around from here. You wanted to see Vijayanagar, didn't you? Where is it? Where is it? Huh? Oh, no! Oh, oh. What a beautiful city, father. Hey, how are you, uncle? I'm fine, Bhaskar. Bhanu, yes? give this gift basket to Chironji, uncle, uh, okay? Sure. Uh, uncle, uncle. Huh? What's this? Oh, uh, uh. Huh? Ah, ghost! Huh? Ghost! Ghost! Save me! Save me! Oh, I almost forgot.
forgot. Bhaskar's friend Chironji was a trader of cotton, wool, and other clothing goods. <laughs> Chironji, uncle. So Yay. this time, my little merchant friend has also come. <laughs> Bhanu, my son, take this huh? coin and have huh? fun at the market while I and Chironji uncle will finish some important work. Okay, father. <laughs> Bhanu Verma went around the market with the same excitement as that of a calf roaming freely in an open field. It was full of colorful shops, game stalls, and street performers. Huh? Uh, uh, Jalebi. Mm. Buy four huh? for just one. Huh? Huh? What a steal! Huh? Come and get it, get it. Just four for one. In uh -huh. my village, uh -huh. we get six uh -huh. for one. Then go back and huh? buy them. Huh? Come and buy huh? one for just one <laughs> coin. You huh? won't find it cheaper anywhere else. Just one coin for such a large fruit. This is a jackfruit, son. Uh -huh. Ask your elders, they'll agree. Uh -huh. Nothing comes close. Not uh -huh. even candies or jaggery. Go uh -huh. on, have a taste. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Here's your coin, uncle. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But this fruit is full of thorns. That's the peel. Cut it and eat the fruit inside. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'm definitely like my merchant father. I bought such a large fruit for just one coin. Father will be very happy. Hmm. Wow. Oh, thorns. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, 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 oh. oh, no, no, no. It's going to fall. It's going to fall. What do I do? What do I do? Ah, 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 ah. Hmm. Wow. Forget jaggery or candy sugar. Even honey doesn't taste this good. It tastes sweet, uh, but it is very sticky. Uh, uh, hey, let go of my hand. Uh, 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 oh, this is even sticking to my clothes. Uh, I think he's having too much fun at the market. He will probably be back by the time we return from the royal palace. Then let's freshen up and leave. Come. His Majesty must be waiting for us. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Bhanu Varma, tired from roaming around all day, fell fast asleep in his hiding place. Uh. Chungi, looks like there is nobody in this house. Uh, uh, oh, they look like thieves. Uh. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. Come on, let's take all the sheep we can carry, Chungi. Uh. Mungi, look. Look at this big fluffy thief. Yes, this one is as good as four. If I scream, everyone will show up here, including father. No, no, it's better. Better if I stay quiet. Uh, 
Chungi, are you sure? We didn't just steal a baby elephant instead of a sheep in the dark? My back is about to break holding it for so long. Come on, wake up. Mungi, looks like the sheep is too tired. <laughs> Just look, it's sleeping so peacefully. A sheep that sneezes? Uh, uh, I'm not a sheep. I'm Bhanu Varma. Mungi, this is a talking <laughs> sheep. This is not a sheep. <laughs> it's a ghost. Ghost. <laughs> I'm so scared. Huh? Uh, me too. Hmm. Ah, I'm a ghost. Chungi, what do we do now? Hey, this seems to be Bhanu's voice. Uh, Bhanu, uh, my son, why are you dressed uh, like this? Uh, uh, father, you? Mm. I, I didn't do anything. It's all that cunning jackfruit's <laughs> fault. The trick is to apply oil on your hands before you touch the jackfruit. But it's fine. At least you learn something new. <laughs> that's uh, true. What's in that bag, father? Bhanu, that's a gift from His Majesty King Vidyadhar. <laughs> wow, what's there in it? That cunning jackfruit again? I don't want to get into any sticky situation again. <laughs> if you like this video, subscribe to our channel, Murti Media.